The Department of Defense told Congress late yesterday it's greenlighted the transfer of a billion dollars to start new barrier construction on the U.S.-Mexico border in two locations, including Yuma. Cronkite News reporter John Cardinelli was in Yuma today to get reaction. The Department of Defense has given a green light to allocate $1 billion towards 56 miles of new border wall here in Yuma County, as well as El Paso, Texas. The money will not only go towards a new border wall, but will also go towards helping fixing roads, as well as establishing lights and drug corridors to help monitor those areas. We spoke with local Yuma residents on their opinion of the construction that may be happening in their community soon believe that even if they build the wall or new streets you know to keep illegal immigrants out they're gonna find a way either way they're they're gonna find a way regardless they're gonna get in here I feel like wasting I think it's wasting money honestly I'm not really sure if the wall is the right answer overall I just know that something should be done to try to you know something should be done to try to make things easier for people to get in but at the same time do something to curb the illegal immigration and the other problems that are going on right now House Armed Services Committee Chairman Adam Smith says he will not reappropriate funds towards the new project, so it is unclear if and when the project will take place. In Yuma, John Cardinelli, Cronkite News.